Dwarf Fortress World Generation, known to take a lot of time, even on uh, very strong computers. It is using only one CPU core, but I want to show you now how much new CPUs are faster than older CPUs, even though it's using only one core. So the difference in performance shouldn't be that much massive. This is my older machine. It's a desktop uh, with an i7-4770K. It is overclocked to 3.9 GHz and it has uh, 16 gigs of uh, DDR3 memory clocked at uh, uh, 1.8 GHz. And on the other side I have a laptop with 11th gen i5. And it has uh, 16 gigs of uh, DDR4 memory. And let's see how big the differences are. I'm gonna run the test and generate a medium word with long history on both of the machines at the same time. Remember we are comparing a laptop, medium range laptop, not, not very expensive one, quite cheap, compared to like a flagship computer from eight years ago. And it is overclocked. Okay, I'm gonna do it almost at the same time. I'm gonna do it on the desktop first and then on the laptop. Okay, and we are generating, and the desktop is generating uh, lakes and minerals, and the laptop already finished. We are at year 40 something. And here we are still generating lakes and minerals. And here, I hope you see the difference. Let's see it side by side. It is side by side, yes, the wall of fortress is side by side on the computers. What the fuck is this song? Why do I make such stupid songs? Humus mesulash mesulash a humus. 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 As you can see, the difference is massive. Don't get confused by the small difference in the amount of years generated. Because while generating history in Dwarf Fortress, every year takes longer to generate than the previous one. It is side by side, yes, the Dwarf Fortress is side by side on the computers. What the fuck is this on? Why?